If you look through my window and you don't I wrote Lonely and Being Alone with Verlin Thompson, um, who I've known for years and years, but we had never written together. But we'd been threatening it for a long time. So finally we put some dates down and I think this was maybe the second or third tune that we'd written together. I'm not quite sure. Um, but that song came about lyrically it's not specifically about my mom but that's where I got the idea um, my mom was by herself five years after my dad passed and and she was always really good with being by herself you know she would she would say I don't mind my own company and um, and I think she truly meant it. Now, of course, she enjoyed, you know, when we came to visit or um, she came and lived in Nashville the last three and a half years of her life. So that was nice. And she got to go to a lot of shows and um, she particularly loved going backstage at the Grand Ole Opry, things like that. Um, but but that idea of just being content is really what the song is about. And um, so so there's a lot of my mom in that song for me um but but verlin you know he just took it to such a beautiful place and and the last verse just really knocked me out you know when he he still drivers were not known for doing gospel material um but i do think a few of our songs um are spiritual in a way um, so I think this one probably falls into that camp um, more than than most of our tunes. Um, so when we played it, uh, the guys really loved kind of the classic country vibe of it, and and Kelvin in particular really loved um, the fact that it had that spiritual component. I think that really spoke to him um so i think it was a neat thing to to include um musically because it's different sounding um but also again lyrically to have a little bit deeper um story going on there and and for me it's a great way to honor my mom <laughs> 